Good evening. Good evening, Good teacher. teacher. Hello, everyone. Good evening, teacher. How are you this evening? How do you feel? I feel I'm happy. Good, you feel happy? That's great. <laughs> That's good to know. Well, welcome to one more week, right? <laughs> we have a, another week and well, this is the class number seven, okay? I will share with you the presentation for this evening class, so you will see it in a moment. Mm -hmm. So today is Monday. Monday what? Very. Monday, January 30th. Uh -huh. yes. Monday, January 30th. <laughs> okay, the topic for this evening's class is expressing preferences, comparison with adjectives. So that's what we are going to learn this evening. Are you ready? Yes, yes teacher. We are ready. Right. Yes, teacher. <laughs> that's the attitude. Well, we have two objectives. The first one is that by the end of the lesson, you will be able to use demonstrative pronouns. This is that those to express possible choice. And by the end of the lesson, you will be able to comprehend and use comparative adjectives. We had a brief introduction to comparative adjectives in the last session. Okay. But today we're going to practice this. Okay. So in this moment, it's time to take the attendance. So please stay present or here. We're going to start with Alejandro and sorry, sorry, are... excuse me, I was in another group. <laughs> this is not you. Give me a moment. This is your group. Okay. So we start with Alba Luz Mendez Campos. Alba Luz Mendez? No, no yet. Okay. Alexandra Patricia Arevalo? Present teacher. Thank you. Alma Ibet Aguirre? Present teacher. Thank you, Alma. Well, people, I just have to tell you, to remind you the uh, regulations and instructions you receive. You know, it's part of the of the program uh, regulations that you have to keep your camera on. You have to connect the sixty minutes. So <laughs> especially when I say attendance, it's so important that you open your camera. Ana Beatriz Martinez. Ana Yamilet Hernández. Blanca Guadalupe Benavides. Present teacher. Blanca. Blanca Mireya Gandani. Caleb Ariel Rivera. Present. Thank you, Caleb. Carlos Antonio Castro. Present teacher. Carlos. Ernesto Rivera Orellana. Carlos Ernesto Orellana. Cecibel Janet Rodríguez. Celia Verónica Pleites López. Claudia Beatriz Madrid. Cristina. Ese. Ok, thank you. Cristina Claribel Chavarría. Delmi Alexander Ramos. Ok, Blanca Mireya. Eh, Delmi Alexandra Ramos, Edma Azalia Marina. Present chair. 
del, eh, sorry, Edwin Alexander Hércules Torres. Here I am, teacher. Sí, good. Efraín Emilio Acevedo. Evelyn Janet Marroquín. Fátima Elisa Marroquín. Here, teacher. Thank you. Fátima Noemí Rivera Rivas. Hilda Pineda. Ever Eliseo Bojorquez. Present teacher. Ever. Héctor Adalberto Velado. Irving Guillermo Villeda Enriquez. I'm here teacher. Okay, Irving. Isaura Vázquez. Present teacher. Thank you, Isaura. Jacqueline Guevara. Jaime Palacios. Present teacher. Thank you, Jaime. Stephanie Rinaldi Mejía. Present. Thank you, Stephanie. Jamile Geraldina Martinez. Okay. I will mention again quickly the names of some people who just connected. Alba Luz Mendez. Um, Ana Beatriz Martinez. Carlos Ernesto Rivera. I'm here, teacher. Okay. Cecibel Rodríguez. Celia Verónica Pleites. Cristina Claribel Chavarría. I'm here, teacher. Okay. <clears throat> Delmi Alexander Ramos. Efraín Emilio. Evelyn Janet Marroquín. Fátima Rivera. Hilda Beatriz. Héctor Pelado. Jacqueline Elizabeth. And Jamila Geraldina. Okay, so that was it. Thank you for connecting on time for your punctuality and responsibility. Okay, so let's start with this evening's class. As I told you, what is the topic? Do you remember the topic? Comparatives. Okay, expressing preferences and comparison. And well, the, the agenda we have in activity one, demonstratives, one and one. Activity two, which one do you prefer? We have a conversation over there. The activity three, we have writing about my favorite clothes and the wrap up. So we are going to learn a lot this class. Let's start. Well, you already know, you already use demonstrative. As the word says, they demonstrate where something is, right? We say, for example, in singular, this is an apple. When it's near you, when it's close to you. But when something is not close, it's far in distance, you say that, that, that is an apple, okay? And in plural, when they are near you, you say these are apples. I can even touch with my hand. But when they are far, you say, those are apples. So um, we're gonna practice, we're gonna have some exercises to practice the use of demonstratives in singular, this and that, and demonstratives in plural. These and those. Okay, so in a moment you will see the, the exercise. In a moment, just give me a moment. Sorry, this is not <laughs> what I wanted to share. Good evening, okay. teacher. Good evening, Anna. I'm sorry. <laughs> Good evening, teacher. 
Uh, good evening. <laughs> Sorry because I'm late. Oh, but you're here. That's good. Yes, okay. teacher. So in this exercise, you have to choose which is the correct word. This is, you know, it's near, close. And that is long in this sentence, far away. Like this ball, but that ball over there. So let's start with this one. This is a car or that is a car? What, which is that? That, 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 that is cool. What about the this, robot? This, 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 this robot. Okay. This, 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 this is a dog. This is a dog. This is a dog. That is a cat. That is a cat. That is a cat. That is a teddy bear. This 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 is a puppy. This is a puppy and that is a rocket. That is a rocket. Let's check. Finish. And then, what is the correct option? Comprobar the, the, this, this one. This is comprobar the answer. <laughs> Excellent, people. You got a 10. Okay, so yes. You can use the demonstratives correctly. You can see the difference between this and that. That is in singular. And what are in plural? Which ones are in plural? Us. This and those. This and those. Yes. What is the difference in pronunciation between this and this? Singular and plural. In plural. Yeah, but the difference in pronunciation? It's more longer. Exactly, mm -hmm. Anna. That's correct. This is longer. Mm -hmm. no, That's okay. This, this. This, this. Those in plural and far away. So let's continue with the lesson. Okay. This, this. This, this. Longer. Be. Well, let's go over the next the slide. In the next slide, uh, we are going to see uh, how we can use in singular to ask about the price of something, we use how much. How much is this necklace? How much is this necklace? Because it's nearby, close. The necklace, I can touch it with my hands, right? How much is this necklace? This one? Yes. Okay, when something is far, you ask, how much is that necklace? That one? Yes, that one. Or you can ask with which? Which one? Why? Which one? The blue one. And then you can answer with the price, right? It's $42. Now, in plural, we don't use is. We use? We use are because it's plural. How much are? How much are these earrings? How much are these earrings? These ones? Okay, because it's near. But if they are far, we say, how much are those earrings? Those ones? Yes. Which ones? The yellow ones. Okay, they are $18. So how much is this? How much is that? How much are these? How much are those? Okay, I will tell you some objects or products and you can tell me if I use okay, how much is or how much are. For example, a book.
a book. How much is this book? Exactly. How much are how much those is books? Book. How much is this, is this book or how much is that book, right? That's... Okay, and what about how much are? For example, I have what I want to say those shoes. How much is this? How much are? How much is are? How much, how much are, are these, these of shoes? shoes? These or, shoes. Or how much are those pair of shoes? How much are? Uh, Other products. Tomatoes. We buy tomatoes <laughs> very often. And we yeah, ask how, them, how much are? How much are those tomatoes? Those tomatoes. Right? When we go to the market or to the store, we ask, how much are those potatoes, those tomatoes, those bananas, right? And imagine it's a watermelon. How would you ask? How much? How much is this? How much is this watermelon or how much are that? Oh, watermelon. 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 Or oh, how much that one? How much is that one? Hmm? How much is that one? Because watermelon is singular. Okay, people, let's go over the next slide. We have conversations here. In this conversation, we have to complete using one, those, one, that, this, and this. Again, we're gonna go over one uh, exercise online, but we're gonna do it together, okay? Are you ready? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> You will see it in a moment. Okay, can you see my screen? Yes. Yes, yes teacher. Nice, very yes, nice. Teacher. Yes, yes. So we have the first conversation and you have to help me to complete. Excuse me, how much are this? Those pants. Those those this jeans this jeans okay um, is she the client or the salesperson salesperson she is a salesperson and she is the client the client okay so can she is she touching the jeans no. 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 Okay. So, excuse me. How much are those? Those. 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 How much are those jeans? Those. And she says, which? Which ones? Which one? Which one? Which ones? Do you mean? The blue ones. The one. Uh -uh. Okay, excuse me, how much are these jeans? Which one do you mean? The, the salesperson is touching the jeans. This. This. Ah, okay. This. Do you mean this? this. Yes. No, the line blue. Light blue. Yeah. Once. The um, light blue one. Teacher. Uh -huh. How do you translate? Do you mean this? Quieres decir esto? Mm. Do you mean? Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, she says. Oh. They are. We have to use this one. Oh, okay. yes. These are. These are expensive. Are. Oh, are expensive? 
Okay, but we have to use one of those ones that be for me. X. Do you mean this? Do you mean those ones? Those ones. Those ones. Those ones. Those ones. Oh, those ones. Oh, sorry, sorry. No, the light those. blue ones. Oh, those are $59.95. Wow, that's expensive. Thank you so much. <laughs> okay, second conversation. How much is this? Is this is this backpack. Back, back, back. Mm, is he touching the backpack? That this one. No. That. that. Exactly. How much is that? that bag? And she says, which one? One. Because it's only one. 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 Which one? The orange. The orange? How much is that backpack? Which one? The orange? The orange piece? I'm sorry guys, I had an internet problem. So the orange? One. 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 <laughs> one. The orange one. one. X36.99. But the, 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 this. This, exactly. This, this green. This green. Green one. This the green, green one. It's only $22.25. That's not bad. Can I see it, please? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. So we use we use one three times. One, two, three. We use those two times. One and two. Okay. Once, two times. Once and one. That only once. These only one and this only one yes excellent we did it correctly let's see great people yes, congratulations wow well this exercise i think you you had a similar exercise in the platform right if you did the exercises in the platform, I can see you did it because you understand this very well. Okay, so let's continue. Now we're gonna have another exercise. Yes, I forgot. <laughs> we have another one. We have another exercise to do. Okay. In this conversation, we don't have a picture, so we need to read carefully. Example number one, excuse me, how much are these shoes? What is the correct, X or there? 279. It's. It's. There. They, 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 why? They, why? It's plural. It's shoes. Exactly. Shoes are plural. Two, right? Plural. We wear two. <laughs> we wear two shoes for only one. Because it has to fit. And the next one. Um, how much is how much that bag over is there? That because it's not that it's not that, 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 that big bag over there. Over there. It is only it, it is only one hundred twenty-nine. 
Yeah. And are the two gray? And are the two gray ones? Ones. 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 No. 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 Are only. Are only. Are only. Oh. This this story is really expensive. Can I help you? Can I help you? Yes, please. Can you let Can I help you? Yes, please. Yes, please. I really like those jeans. Those jeans over there. How much are they? How much are they? Are they? Which ones? Which one? one? We mean this? 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 Second option. This? Yes. <laughs> because it's plural. Mm -hmm. No. The no. The black one. ones. Let me, Let me look. look. Oh, they are there. They are twenty-five. Teacher, and no bad. And we don't it's mention no. the the. So much. We don't mention the that or the, no, the punto. Just thirty-five with ninety-nine. Okay. Uh, mm -hmm. 35.99 or 35 with 99? Okay. <laughs> this is not bad. That's not bad. That's not bad. Yeah. How, How much, 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 much is, is this? Is sweater here? Is this sweater here? Sweater here. It's, here. it's it's only, only 99. Wow, I see the girls are, you know, with all the energy, with all the power, and that's great. <laughs> okay, so we have the answers. Wow, yes. <laughs> yes. So happy for you. <laughs> okay, so good you, good, good job. But boys, please participate too, not only the girls, okay? Uh -huh. Don't fall asleep. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah. You see some tips. Only ever have the camera on. And the others, and the other boys, the other girls. Okay. <clears throat> so in the next slide, we have important, <clears throat> thank you, Caleb, important information. Uh, we can use the plus the adjective plus one or one. If it's singular, one. If it's plural, one. One. Yeah, one. Is it green? Example. I would like to one. try it on a jacket. One. Which one? One. The green one. Me gustaría probarme esa cha una chaqueta. ¿Cuál? La verde. La verde. I would like to try it on a jacket. Which one? Okay. Letter B. Where are my shoes? Which, Which ones? Ones. The black shoes. The black ones. The black ones. Exactly. Because. Plural. They are plural. Which letter C? Do you know my these shoes? shoes? No, really. I prefer the other ones. Exactly. Because shoes are plural. So the, um, it says that plus adjective plus one or one. Here we have that. What is the adjective? Green. Green. Yes, the colors. colors are the color. They are characteristic. The, the green color. ones, the black ones. Well, here it doesn't. It doesn't say right. The 
But we can also use other adjectives like the small ones, the big ones, the pretty ones, the only ones, the new ones, the old ones. Right? We can use those adjectives. And what they mean in one in ones? Uh, they refer to the object. Para decir ese o esa, la verde, esa verde, the green one, the black one, los negros. Pero tenemos que decir one or ones, no solo puedo decir the black. The ah, black okay. one. Okay. Mm -hmm. Good. Any other question? I guess no. So which one do you prefer? Which one? ¿Cuál prefieres? Which one do you prefer? The black jacket or what color is this? Mm, maybe green or light blue? <laughs> okay, so we have a conversation and I'm gonna read and you please listen to the pronunciation. Look. These jackets are really nice. Which one do you prefer? I like the wool one better. The wool one? Why? It looks warmer. Well, I like the leather one better. It's more stylish than the wool one. Mm, there's no price tag. Excuse me, how much is this jacket? It's $499. Would you like to try it on? Uh, no, that's okay, but thanks anyway. You're welcome. <laughs> so why do you think she didn't she didn't want to try on the jacket? Sorry, teacher. Why do you think she didn't want to try it on the jacket? Why didn't she want to try it on the jacket? Why she didn't try it on the jacket? Because it's expensive. Because it's more expensive. Yeah. It's too expensive. Yes. Very expensive. So it's like when you go to a, um, a store and when you see the price or the price, mm -hmm. you say, no. I don't even try it. <laughs> okay. So in this conversation, we, we she asks, which one do you prefer? Why? Because she has two options. Mm -hmm. And what is her answer? She asks, which one do you prefer? And she said, I like the wool one Prefer. better. Uh, we can yeah. use this expression para decir, me gusta oh, más yeah. la de la, me gusta más esta. Okay? Yes. I like the wool one better. Wool one? Why? Why? It's it looks warmer. Warmer. warmer and better are what type of adjective? Comparative. Comparative, exactly. And why are we using comparative? With the, with the wool jacket. How many jackets? Two jackets. Two, two jackets. But remember, we use comparative adjectives when we compare two things, mm -hmm. only two things. So we have two jackets, and that's why you're using comparative adjectives. I like the wool one better. It looks warmer, right? Mm -hmm. And the other one. What the meaning, teacher? It looks warmer. Mm, that, um, okay, warmer. Like when it's cold, you need a jacket to warm. Ah. Mm -hmm. okay. 
Okay. Salvadorian Spanish. Bueno. <laughs> Se ve más calientita, right? Salvadorian Spanish. <laughs> okay. So she says, I like the leather one. Le leather one. Leather one. Leather one better. Leather. La de cuero, right? I like the leather one better. It's more stylish than the full one. So again, it's comparing using comparative, but in this adjective, it's a long adjective. So I don't say it's a stylisher. No, we just add more. It's more stylish than the full one. Than the full one. Mm -hmm. There's now let's try to practice with the well we have more information I would like a volunteer to read who can help me read which dress do you prefer mm -hmm. I prefer I the prefer blue one the blue one why? It's it nicer than the black one. Yes, thank you. Second. Which one do you like more? I like the blue one more. Why? It, it's lighter than the black one. It's lighter than the black one. Okay, lighter than the black one. Which one do you like better? I like the black one better. It's more stylish. It's stylish than stylish. the blue one. Yes, it's more stylish, Elma. <laughs> I like the black one better. So as, as we learned in the last class, when we have a, a comparative adjective, well, the rule is to add ER. Chip? Cheaper, nice. Cheaper, nicer. Nice. Bigger. Bigger. In this case, we double. Pretty. 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 We drop the word. And we, yeah, I E R, prettier, prettier, I have some questions for you. Um, sorry, let me okay here. Okay, if I ask you which subject do you prefer? Math or English? Maybe English. I prefer math. I prefer English. <laughs> Why? <laughs> okay. Um, <laughs> I prefer English class. In this case, because we, we didn't, uh, I prefer English. X. It's more easy than more easy. Math. More easier. easy or easier? Easier. Easier. Easier, easier. easier than math. Than math. Than, sorry, than Math. There's something here, yes. Okay. Oops, another one, another question. Which do you prefer? Which do you prefer? Or which uh, do you like? Which do you like more? The morning or, or the evening? evening? I 
I like I like more. I like more. I like more. I like, I like the evening. The evening. The evening. Why? Because it is. I sleep is more. I sleep more. <laughs> <laughs> but if you use an adjective for uh, the class, which do you like more to have a class in the morning or in the evening? Um, the evening. 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 Why? And I in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Anna. It's like better. Oh, okay, I say it's better. Maybe because you have more time and you are more relaxed. Or you can say, I am more relaxed. I am more yeah. relaxed. And relaxed is an adjective. But oh. sometimes we are asleep. <laughs> <laughs> so relax that you sleep. <laughs> For the time. Okay. Why, why don't you I make some questions in the chat? Okay. Please write some questions like this. Like, which do you prefer? Which do you prefer? And we're going to practice the comparative adjective. Which do you prefer? Which? Which? Eh, o sea, no, no entendí, teacher. ¿Me podría explicar? Okay, <laughs> yes. Write a question in the chat with which do you like more? Which do you prefer? Mm -hmm. And the, your classmates will answer the question. Me, yo casi no le entendí tampoco. Podría decirlo. Es un momento un poquito en español. Mm -mm. I will try to explain again in English. Okay, in English then. Which means cuál, ¿verdad? Solo van a hacer una pregunta parecida, solo le van a cambiar las cosas. Por ejemplo, allí Edma puso, which do you prefer? Coffee or orange juice? Mm, ok. Uh -huh. Y de ahí usted va a responder. Los demás van a responder. I prefer. I prefer orange use. Why? It healthier. Es, ahí va a usar un comparativo. Es más saludable. It's healthier. Thank you, Miss. You're Thank welcome. you, Miss. Okay. Hilda, which earring do you like? Silver or gold? It's okay, teacher. Which earrings do you like? Oh, mm -hmm. which do you like better? Or do you like more? Uh, uh, sorry. Solo faltó eso. Which earrings do you like more? Or do you like better? Which do you prefer more? High heels or tennis? It depends, Isaura. <laughs> Which do you like more? The pink color or the green color? Which do you like more? Jeans or shorts? Uh, to be at home, shorts. Which do you prefer? Color hat? Cold. Which weather do you prefer? Color hat. <laughs> Which do you like more? Sweet or sour? <laughs> Green mangoes. <laughs> Sour. Uh, which kind of music do you prefer? Romantic music or pop music? I prefer shorts. They are more comfortable. Shorts son plurales. 
shorts, porque tenemos dos piernas, two legs, shorts. Which do you prefer more, milk or chocolate? Which do you prefer, Real Madrid or Barcelona? Exactly, Blanca. Very good. Uh, which do you prefer, English music or Spanish music? Definitely English music. Definitely. <laughs> uh, it's because I don't know why, but sometimes the Spanish music or Latin music, it's just like, you know, double sense. Which do you prefer, pupusas or chicken? Oh, I think I prefer pupusas. They are more delicious and cheaper. <laughs> Pupusas or campero chicken? Pupusas. Pupusas. <laughs> I okay. prefer. Answer the classmates' questions. <laughs> Very nice. Okay. Now in the next, uh, this exercise, which was the homework. Creo que solo una persona me lo mandó. Uh, this is to practice comparatives. We'll try to do it together. Give me a moment, just give me a moment. Como van en la plataforma. He llegado hasta el examen. Midterm. Y así tienen que hacerlo. El, ya deberían haberlo hecho. El midterm. Yes, teacher. Yes, I, I, me too. Uh -huh. Ok. So, let's see. What is the comparative form of John? All. No, the comparative, not the opposite. Younger. Ah, uh, yes. Younger. Younger. Boring. Young, younger. Boring. 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 More boring. More. More, More boring. boring. Easy. Easier. 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 Interesting. More, inter more, more interesting. More interesting. Hot. Hot. How do you spell it? More hot. H-O-T-E-R. -E double T, right? Because yes. it's consonant, vowel, consonant. I doubled the last consonant. Talkative. Um. Talk talk more. More talkative. More talkative. Sad. <laughs> Can you repeat the, the pronunciation? Talkative. Talkative. Don't pronounce the L. Don't pronounce the L. Just talkative. Talkative. Adder. Talkative. When people talk a lot of it's total. Like a parrot. Talkative. Talkative. <laughs> Yeah. I double okay. or I D. don't double yes. yes. double the D. Yes. Shy. 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 I'm not sure. Más triste. Yeah, I, I'm not sure about this one because sí. I see my more shy. Timid. 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 Más timid. More friendly. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, you, we can use both friendlier or more friendly. I mean, okay. that. friendlier. Okay, friendlier. new, newer, mm -hmm. attractive, 
more, more attractive. attractive. More attractive. Who is more attractive, Brad Pitt or Tom Cruise? I am. <laughs> Light? Lighter. Lighter. No comments, no comments, right? No comments. <laughs> Lighter. Confident. More confident. More confident. In the past, Brad Pitt. Lighter. Yeah. Quiet. Okay. <laughs> okay. Quiet. 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 But we can say quieter or we can say more quiet. Both are correct. And sometimes in America they use it in one form and in England they use it in a, in the other form. Okay, quieter. Famous. More famous. More famous. Strong. Stronger. Stronger. The rule here, I would say that is how it sounds. Si suena demasiado extraño, entonces de la otra manera. Más que todo en inglés, así es, como se escuche. Ok, important. More important. More important. Dirty. Dirty. That is here. Short. 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 Brave. 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 Let's choose the correct form. Um, more hard Hard worker or hard working <laughs> than <laughs> my sister. <laughs> hard worker. Soy. I'm more hard working. Because the adjective is hard working. Hard mm -hmm. worker is a noun. It's a noun. It's trabajador. Trabajador. Duro. Mm. Tra buen trabajador. Hard working es trabajar duro, trabajando duro, trabajador. Y este es el adjetivo, hard working. So more hard working than my sister. Elephants are more big, bigger or bigger than horses? More big. Bigger. Bigger. Yeah. bigger. With double bigger. G or with one G? Double G. G. Double G. Yeah. Cats are more fast than bikes. Faster with double faster. T or faster. faster. One T or two T? Two one. T. Uh, one T. One. Only one, one because I think it has one. consonant, vowel, consonant, consonant. <clears throat> it has two consonants, so we do need to double the other consonant. Jets are more expensive, expensive or expensive than cheap. More, more expensive. expensive. More expensive. My dad is serious, or more serious, or serious than my mom. More, more, more serious. serious. More serious. Comics are more funny, fun, funnier, or funnier than magazines. Funnier. 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 This or this? The last one. Mm -hmm. Ah, you are using one. The last one. The last one. Uh -huh. The last one. <laughs> Okay, my own is more intelligent, intelligent, comparative form, more intelligent. more intelligent. My friend is more brave, braver, or braver. 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 Okay, I get up. Ese, el braver no significa bravo. No me deja pensar que significa es más bravo que yo. Es valiente. Uh, exacto. Uh -huh. Like a movie. I get up. I get up more early, earlier or earlier than my brother. Earlier. 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 And math is more difficult, difficult, more or difficult. difficult. More difficult. More difficult. More difficult. Than history. Okay, let's see. Teacher, I didn't uh, pass the mm. homework. I'm sorry, Anna. Uh, I didn't. Okay, it's a mark. 
la tarea, entonces, porque entendí mal. Hasta ahorita estoy entendiendo. Ah, ok. <risa> ¿Cómo era la dinámica? <risa> ah, don't worry. Anna. Pero bueno. The important is that you understand. Ok. Ok. Okay. So now let's see the class. We are here. Well, class, we the, the time just run away. I will send you this, okay? Oh, maybe we have five minutes, okay? So we can do it. We have some conversations and we have to complete. For example, which of these jackets do you like more? I prefer the leather one. The design is? Nicer. 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 And it looks? More expensive. More expensive. Than? More expensive wall than wall. the wool one. Than the wool one. Yeah, we have to also use that word. Than. Okay, these sweaters are nice. Which one do you prefer? I like, I like the gray one better. The color is prettier. Prettier. It's more attractive than the brown. The brown and yellow one. More attractive than the brown and yellow one. Which rings do you like better? I like the silver one. They are smaller. It's smaller. smaller. The gold one. Smaller. Than. Than. The gold one. The gold one. And there. Cheap. Cheaper. 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 Uh -huh. So these are useful expressions that we can use <laughs> when we talk. The color is prettier. That time is nicer. That time for a practice. Okay. Since we have this, um, another exercise that I now I'm going to share things for you to do it in your as homework because we don't have more time. But yeah, somebody asked if I can send. I will send. I will try to send it after the session because I know it's important to practice and practice and practice. Okay? And this is going to be another assignment. Writing about my favorite clothes. You will write a paragraph about your favorite clothes. What do you like to wear? And compare your clothes to the ones you don't like. About. Example, my favorite clothes are cotton t shirts. Jeans. T shirts are more comfortable than shirts and ties. And I think jeans are nicer than pants. I know that suits are more stylish, but so this is just the beginning of the paragraph. But in this paragraph, you're going to compare your favorite clothes or your favorite shoes. Right? I can compare it sneakers and high heel sandals or formal shoes or clothes. You choose clothes. You can choose clothes or shoes. <laughs> okay, so well guys, um, I don't know if you have any other comments or questions. Uh -huh. Miss, no entendí mucho cuándo es que le agrega el more. Cuando el adjetivo es largo. Por ejemplo, cuando uh -huh. el adjetivo es largo, como intelligent, interesting, beautiful, entonces, uh -huh. more beautiful, more comfortable, more intelligent, uh -huh. okay, more yes. colorful. Welcome. Eh, y de este, fíjense que de este ejercicio es bien largo el ejercicio. Yo solo tomé este porque dije, no lo vamos a hacer toda la clase. Pero lo escriben en su cuaderno. La respuesta. I hope you can see it. Ok. 
and I will send the other links later. Um, uh, just one important information. Class, I, I, um, I will say it in Spanish so that everyone can. For motivos de fuerza mayor, la, no tendremos clase mañana. Entonces, la clase de mañana estará cancelada, pero sí vamos a tener el miércoles. Esta semana va a ser la única excepción en la que sí tendremos clase miércoles. Así que, si pueden, eh, bueno, recibirán un mensaje en el WhatsApp para recordarlo. Pero no habrá clase mañana, pero sí miércoles, jueves y viernes. ¿Ok? Ok, teacher. Que tengan feliz noche. Have a good night. Bye. Good night. Bye. 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 B